So like I've been talking about for a while, I'm finally going on vacation. We're finally leaving. It was pretty shit the last few days, and I wanted to do the last few things. Got all these videos uploaded. I'm going to make some thumbnails, pre-post a few of them, probably just two. And then maybe I'll set up another Mia sleep stream because that went really well while I'm doing other things. I'll just set up the Mia sleep stream. For, yeah, for some reason, you guys really like that. Look at this mess. All right, my car is uh, basically all packed up. See, I'm upset. May have a little secret for you. I may not be coming back to Quebec, so this one I want to get rid of everything. I'm totally fucking done with the French. But yeah, I got everything loaded up. We'll go get breakfast soon, then we head out on the Canadian adventure. I was thinking we nap too, but but I mean I don't know. I feel like we should leave in an hour. But you're napping, so it's like should should I nap too? Are we napping? Should we have a nap? Are you ready to go on a walk and go outside? Or are we napping? You ready to go on an adventure, or do you want to have a nap? Okay. I guess vacation's on hold until she's up. Come here. We're out here. You're so pretty. Look how cute you are. Yeah, look at you. Oh, this is pretty. Pretty nice. Oh. I think those stairs are too big for you, honestly. We can go for it. Alright, come on. So we're currently in Trois-Rivières, and the farther I get into Quebec, the less English there is. But it's okay, we're exploring, Amy. It's also kind of funny too, the farther you get in, again, there's less English. But this, a homeless guy said, uh, you know, ça va, which is, how are you in French? And I replied in English, and he looks at me and goes, oh, you're English? And I'm like, yeah, and he goes, have a good day. He didn't even ask me for money. He asked the last guy for money, but he didn't ask me for money. Fucking racist. Okay, come on. Don't give up now. You're rocky. Mia, can you sit? You listen, you sit. 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 Mia, sit. Mia, sit. Mia, I want to take a picture. Mia. You done? Wanna go see? Mia. Mia. Well, now we're back in the car. Uh, so everyone seems nice here. Not really anything to do. A lot more poor people than in Montreal. Like there are so many just beggars sitting on that one festival street oh wait i'm supposed to go left here but yeah now we're off to quebec city i was gonna get some food here but then i decided against it because i don't, don't want to waste too much time here quebec city i'll do more exploring and maybe more like something decent i think i'll do something some sort of activity in quebec city I heard once that like in America there's two trees for every person and in, in certain different places there's like one tree or half a tree for every person and in Canada there's like 30 trees for every person and I never understood that until now like there's nothing but fucking trees. Hello Quebec City and there's mountains over there I didn't know there's mountains in Canada that's a rare sight to see. Mia are you enjoying the grass? In the shade. Yeah. Mia. Mia, what are you doing? What are you doing? But I really don't, I mean, I don't know if I just give off English vibes, but when people walk up to me, they speak English. But when everybody else passes me, it's French. And I'm, it's getting more and more French as we go, but we're enjoying it. Oh, Mia's dropping a shit. Mia, why are you so slow? Mia. Mia.
That's pretty nice. Being honest, guys, if my car isn't around this corner, it's lost somewhere in Quebec. And then I think we're fucked. I'm sweating like a fucking horse, man. It is so hot. I still haven't gotten food. I think that's the play. Get out of Quebec City, get some food, then come back when it's later and less busy. It's all French. I'm gonna assume this one's good. So we found a nice place to eat my food. I thought a brisket was like, it came on like a bun, but it fucking doesn't. It's just the meat, which is what I wanted. I wanted the pulled pork, but. You see, I mean, it looks good, but it would probably be better on a bun. You know, I don't have a bun. I wish I brought a bun, and then I would have like set this up. If I knew this is what I was getting, I would have went and bought a bun. This on a bun would have been fire. I paid like $35 for just this and then coleslaw, but I don't like coleslaw. I like they're going to be fries. That's why the language barrier sucks. I can't get proper food here. Fat ass bitch. I went out to the festivity. I went out and I realized I'm not French. So again, what the fuck is the point of me going out for anything, you know? It just makes no sense. I didn't even know there was a special day going on. So who cares? I'd rather go sleep. Done with Quebec. Here I am, sitting in Walmart. It is 8 o'clock and I've never been so tired so early. And I think tomorrow morning I'll just go through Quebec City a little bit more and record it a little bit better like a few spots that I saw that I wanted to record and then we'll head over to the next city but right now again I'm just so tired I would go to the festivity festivities I went to one girl that like I saw outside show but they were just speaking in French again and some song like the songs were English and then they start speaking like viva le Quebec and it's like shut the fuck up Sing your shitty French songs then. <sighs> Let's hope we don't get robbed by a crackhead. The beautiful sunset. And the beautiful Mia. Are you tired? Drink your water, Mia. Jesus. So pretty. Walmart sunset. Walmart. Fireworks. There's even more There's fireworks here. This is a big show over here. Walmart fireworks. Good morning. It is 7.30, I wish I slept till 9, I may go to sleep even more, but first we're gonna go get gas, cause we're almost out, food, and we're on day two. Yesterday I spent like $80, and I wanna keep it to about $50 a day if I can, and do as cheap as a trip as I can. But um, yeah, gas was a lot, and now it's gonna be another $50 of gas, and then food. Who knows, maybe we're gonna pull a guy from the Penny vlogs and do some work somewhere. Oh, thank you. Have a good one. This place seems pretty cool. I mean, look. Pretty nice. 
Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, to the next city we go. I think we should go get food now and then we'll figure out where we want to go. <laughs> she doesn't even care. Yeah. Yeah. Look. Look, sit. Sit. Yeah, look at you. Oh, I don't want to drop my phone in there. Look at you. Yeah. Come on, Mia. You got this. It's a big hill. You've got this. I don't think I was allowed to park there. I think I officially crossed out of, yeah, it's official. I'm out of shitty ass Quebec and I'm in New Brunswick. Yes. All right. All right. I think I'm going to give in and go get an Airbnb today. Or not an Airbnb, like a motel today. Because it's hot and I'd rather just edit and I'm already out of Quebec. Uh, and then tomorrow I'll start my, uh, in New Brunswick. Yeah. This province is so green and hilly. It's nice. You should. You guys saw the videos. There it is. Welcome to New Brunswick, motherfuckers. Very nice. 16 and Very 6 nice. pack. It is so hot out here, and your feet probably hurt from being on that thing. I got a pretty good burger though. I'm just watching you enjoy yourself. You enjoy yourself. She, I opened the door and she picked the sun. Yeah, and she's just out in the sun enjoying it. Hopefully you don't get too hot. I love you, Mia. You're my friend, you're my best friend, my only friend. Pretty girl. All right, guys, a little bit emotional right now, but that's just how it goes. I decided I broke. I got a motel like I said I was going to do, and I didn't actually know if I was gonna do it, but it's just a little expensive, so that's a little bit stressful, but it's really nice. I got a nice, wait, let me show you. I had to pay a little extra to allow me in, but they let it. And I'm only upset right now because while well, I was talking to my mom, Shouts out to my mom, I love my mom. And I was stressed, I didn't want to get this place, but it was so hot and Mia was dying in the car. So, I went and got this place, it was like 170 bucks. And I didn't want to do that, I didn't want to, but I didn't, it's okay, and I'll just sleep in, in my car at Walmart another day or whatever. But it's expensive, and I was thinking to myself, oh man, maybe I'll just have to cut my vacation a few days short, because it's, it's really just me winging it, I really don't know what I'm doing. And at the end of it, I'm either going to find a place in Nova Scotia or in New Brunswick to uh, get an office and stream. But first, it's just been stressful. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just glad to be out of Quebec. I felt so stuck there and so hated by everybody. It was just sad. It, was, it sucked a lot. And I didn't really have any friends. It was just all clicked up in Quebec. Maybe that's my own fault. But, yeah. Anyways, shouts out to my mom. Love my mom. She sent me $200 for this. Cause I told her I was stressed. I was like, it doesn't really matter, I'm just stressed. And she offered to pay, and I was like, no, just, you know, my birthday's tomorrow, send me something for my birthday. And then she said 200, and then she's like, oh, it's for your birthday week, and I've missed a few, so here you go. Just makes me sad. So I'll end this off like this, and I'll see you in tomorrow's video. All I'll say is, keep your family close. Always love your mother. And don't stress when you don't need to.